was all my crispy bacon down there, guys. This is your boy, Crispy Chris, and this is actually a topic that I never really talked about on my channel because I haven't really brought it around much, and that's pretty much talking about zombies and how to rank up in zombies in Black Ops 3 because, as you guys know, this is the first year that we actually have a ranking system in Call of Duty Black Ops 3 or the Black Ops series where zombies is implemented into a ranking system where you can prestige. But the thing is, guys, is that it is very difficult to level up. And it takes a long time. Even longer than how it takes to even prestige in the multiplayer in Black Ops 3. But, guys, I have some tips for you guys to use and to implement into your guys' gaming in order to create the better waves or the better amount of XP that you can earn in Black Ops 3 Zombies. So, pretty much, guys, what you want to do is... First off, go for high rounds. High rounds is going to be your biggest thing because every round that you complete, you're going to get plus 1,000 XP. And that XP actually adds up over and over and over again. But one of the biggest things, guys, is completing challenges. And what I mean by challenges is that Black Ops 3 has implemented different challenges that go with various guns. Actually, every single gun in the game. Even the guns that you get from the mystery box and things like that. Also, what you guys got to do is go for the couple challenges, go for like five or six challenges for one weapon, and then switch it up around, switch it up here and there, and just try and be very independent on other weapons. Just don't sit there and be dependent on one weapon. Make sure to actually switch your guns out and to use each weapon thoroughly and complete all the challenges that you can, because the more challenges, the better off you are completing and leveling up in Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies. I've seen a lot of this go down, especially in my recent uh, gaming, especially with zombies and things like that when I'm hanging out with my friends. I sit there and I'm that person that actually uses one weapon because I feel like that weapon is very overpowered and things like that. But as I started to switch my guns out every five or so challenges or every five or so rounds, I began to see a trend that my leveling up was becoming a lot faster and XP started coming up a lot more. And then with me pack a punching my weapons and actually going for headshots, my XP boosted by a lot. And it was just crazy to think though how many of these how much XP I can earn just from changing up one small thing in my gameplays and things like that. But hopefully you guys do take this in into consideration. You guys can also earn XP by opening doors and things like that. But I would also su suggest going and playing solo and Call of Duty Black Ops 3 because solo you guys will be able to earn the biggest amount of kills you'll be able to easily go through everything and by opening all the doors that's all reliable on you also you're gonna be getting all the kills you don't have to worry about people getting in your way and taking your kills which is also a positive thing but the thing is guys is that each kill is only worth 100 points I believe it's not like where you get like the two hit markers in the first round and the knife them you get the 130 whichever whatever it is but you don't get that huge amount of XP it's actually every kill is a hundred points so in third and doubt it doesn't really matter about the amount of points that you get but points do help pack a punch in your weapon is also a good help because if you guys get weapon off the wall pack a punch in that weapon is going to actually complete the pack a punching challenges that you guys can use for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 so there's multiple challenges that you guys can go for just don't focus on one weapon and that's the biggest thing is what I'm saying is don't focus on one weapon try and stay away from staying with one gun for the whole game switch it up every so often and try and go for the high rounds where you guys can actually earn the most XB for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies if this does help you guys make sure to leave a like hopefully you guys do enjoy this video make sure to like comment and subscribe if you guys are new to my channel but as always, guys, it's been your boy, Chris to Chris, and I'll see you guys on the flip side. Peace. Or a Batman-type deal camo. What do you guys think? I would honestly love to see this go.